has more recently pivoted uh, towards concussion, concussions. Now, they're not, uh, on its face, you would think, what do concussions and depression have to do with one Yeah, another? I was about to ask that. Yeah, um, and, and, and in actuality, the symptoms of concussion and the symptoms of depression overlap quite significantly. Uh, people report concentration difficulties. People with concussions that have never struggled with depression before start having depression symptoms, uh, anxiety symptoms even. Excuse me for a second. Um, to prove that you have a common cold today. Thank you. <laughs> thanks thanks for sharing that sound effect just so everyone knows that you actually do have a cold today. So thank you. Um, <laughs> uh, uh, so there, there is significant overlap uh, between the two. It, it also seems to be the case that um, a lot of the time people are experiencing maybe their first concussion in high school sports, for instance. It also uh, lines up with about the first time that people really start struggling with depression. That's also a really... Um, important time of life when when people are kind of maybe for the first time struggling with those feelings. Can you tell t tell everyone what the age range is you're talking about? Yeah, I'd say uh, somewhere between I don't know 13 to 25, maybe 15 to 21, even more so. But um, you know, there's so much variability. And, and this is when this is when symptoms of depression start becoming more apparent. Is that what you're saying? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. And, uh, and one of the ways that it can really tie into to concussion is, um, so having a single concussion for most people, especially if it's a concussion from football or hockey or, or uh, 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 soccer or whatever, um, most people make a full recovery from that. No symptoms after the first month or so. Um, we're talking rates of, you know, 70 to 95 percent of individuals will go on to make have a full recovery after a single sports related concussion uh, but that's not everybody right